So down here at Garran Park today, um, it's actually my home course, but we've never done a video reviewing it, so we thought today would be a good day to do it whilst the course is looking nice after all the lockdowns. Um, so Garran's has got three nine hole courses, and it's also got a nine hole par three pitching and putt course, driving range, mini golf, and a putting green. So there's a lot of facilities here um, for all abilities and all ages as well. Um, and yeah, we're gonna get out on the course today and play a bit of golf and show you around. Yeah, so we're going to start um, by playing the west um, and then going on to the east. To be honest, I'll play any course at the moment, any condition. This has been four months, can't wait to get out there and play. And uh, to be fair, the west and the east are probably the two nicest courses. The, the other one's called the south. Uh, south is probably the hardest out of the three. Uh, the east is probably the easiest, but I'm sure that our scores won't reflect, reflect that today. But we'll get, get some clips and show you around. Now this hole, is my most hated hole. R5 and that hedge is about 250 so you've got to be a big hitter to be carrying it. I'm not. So I'm trying a new method today. I'm imagining a par 3 hole as this part before the hedge and the back of the hedge is the back of the uh, the green. So I just want to just get it down there. You're going to quote Rory again. Not, not quoting Rory right now. This is, this is a Matt special. But I'm going to just pretend that there's a nice green down there. And that's fine, I'm happy with that, I'll take that. To be over the hedge in two on this hole is good, so if I can do that, I'll be happy. Dan's got the big dog out. Now those are hat-trick of pars in Matt a row. And he's had four, four pars so far, so he's playing off scratch. Matt talked about strategy, I'm just happy to hit it straight, regardless of what happens after that. Is it straight? Straight in the straight in the straight in the, rough. straight in the pond. You better take one off the tee, mate. Going for a provisional now. As he knocked out a fish with the last one. Better. I should have done that first time. Up right near me. Perfect. Matt's most hated hole. Not a bad first shot. Wind behind me, so I should be on for a bit of distance here, hopefully, if I catch it. Straight down the middle, as Frank Sinatra says. Can't see nothing over that bush, though. As you'll see on the picture up at the start of the hole, dog legs around to the left. down the fairway. It's on its way. No par for you though on this hole. No. Well, could be. I could chip it in from here. <laughs> from there. Stranger what? things have happened. Exactly. Might as well have some hope. If West Ham get a top four finish this season then anything's possible. Don't go that far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah I mean miracle. <laughs> That's got the range finder out. 112 to the bottom of the pin. We've got a review video coming on this soon. It's gifted to us by an Amazon supplier. So uh, we'll let you know how it is. I'm giving it a few rounds, test it out, see how accurate it is. We already know it won't improve either of our game, no. but it's whether, whether it's accurate enough. But, but we'll test that shortly. Holding back, lovely, take not that. Not bad, not bad. And when we div it went. Dan's about 100. 120 actually. Well he thinks 120, I thought I was 112. That's why he went past. 
was hoping for the backspin. Dancing as well. Like that. We are looking good today. Don't know why that is. No. I really don't. Maybe that's all we needed was a four month layoff and we're yeah. uh, not, as, not as crap as we thought we were. No, we definitely are. Yeah. I just think we've got all of our luck on the same day. Yeah. <laughs> good job I got Euro Millions ticket for tonight. Yeah, I got two of them. 113 million, that'd be nice. They go full time. Yeah. Dan's got a long old putt. I've got a long one as well, mine's for Birdie. Like I thought ever. this was closer. Got any better it was a better shot than it actually was. So. Today could be a good day. Gone left. Nah, not too sad short. though, from that distance. Matt's worst hole, hated hole. He's on for birdie. Quite a long way down here. Come round. Not quite. Oh, Nearly yeah, there. Come round. Still on for par though. I'll take Still that one. Par. It's not guaranteed par. Long par three. It's telling two, about two twenty two seventeen to the back. To the back. It's telling me on my into the wind. Range finder. again for his par three. Points picked up as well. They're gonna make it. Just on the edge of Wind's the green. Pretty strong though. Had to keep it low. Went straight. Well, I'm gonna make out that I, I knew I was keeping it low. Tactics, How'd you do that then? Tactics and all What's that. What's the technique? I'd like bit of water on the left. Anywhere but left. Ah, sliced. Major. Lost about 50 yards of distance there. Eh? Still though. Banana skin. It's not in the water. Nah. It's all good. Yet. Dan's already knocked out a duck from the other side of the pond. Can he get yep. another from this Killed side? One. Take that. Yeah. Up near the bunkers. Gonna Can't battle. complain, Mr. Water, so I'm always happy. Missing the water is a bonus when you're as poor at golf as I am. I've done it, not a bad little drive on his first one, so par five, second shot. About 240 to the green, I'd say. Now comes Trusty Hybrid. You would not believe this guy got three pars in a row. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Lucky now. Oh, oh yeah. Just... It's over the path. Uh, a bit unlucky that. So Dan, how are you finding Garen so far? Um, yeah, it's nice. It's been it's quite well kept considering we've had some really poor weather. I know no golf's been played on it for 
four months, but I think they've done quite a good job and the fairways are quite firm, greens are in good condition, so yeah, I'm, I'm not playing too bad, so, so considering, considering I've uh, not, not even hit a ball for four months, yeah, it's going all right, but ask me and ask me again in another half an hour and I might give you a different, different answer. Yeah, it does tend to hold up all right in the uh, in the rain, to the extent even after the worst winter we've ever had. We've still got buggies and trolleys allowed now, so happy days. Man. Let's try and get... Then what's it like? Let me just... Brave shot. Well, was... I'm going for it here. I'm, I'm going to rain it a bit. A bit of a gap. Laying up. They say that trees are 90% air, so let's hope I don't hit the 10% that isn't. I didn't hit that tree, but hit one further down. It's down there anyway. Well, it's over there, it's over. It'll do. Caught it nicer. Oh, I took that a little bit left. Oh yeah, just up on that mound. That's so right, it was though. definitely the right club, but um, not the right connection. Nah, just hooked that a little bit. So never mind. <laughs> a bit, a bit of a difficult shot now for Matt. Mainly because he's got a tree. Looks like it's growing out of his ear. Over the bunker, I'm gonna get all these green marks over me new white hat as well. I hope the tree put me off. Wrong club. It's not gone far. Absolute pony. Similar. Because I had mud in me grooves, that's what it was. See, I've just said the course is firm and he's saying he's got mud in the groove, so they don't go together, them two statements. Send this in hot, straight to the pin. Nope. Send it in shot. Nope. Far four. Tricky hold this one. Right, left of the tree is where we're aiming for. The green. Can we get it there? Nope. One. One. <laughs> one. Past the tree on the fairway. Lovely Good job, shot. Good shot. It's before the tree. Yeah. Down the right way, though. Dan's second shot is on the ninth on the west. So you've got water and the green shed. Let me see down, that's our flag and then that's the ninth on the east. Dan's going for it, he's not laying up. Made it over. Yep. Long putt, but you're on the dance floor. Roy McAvoy and Tin Cup. <laughs> Give but me lucky another I bar. Go through seven balls to get there. So yeah. 108. Says the range five range finder that we're um, gonna do a review on. Pitching wedge. It says 108, but it's quite uphill. Bit of wind. Elevated though, isn't it? Elevated green. Pond in front of it. No pressure. Then I can hit it like Bryson at times. Right, I sink it then. Lost 
too long. A bit far. I think so. We can tell it was a bit far, Matt, because the uh, the zoom couldn't even go far enough to oh. take that. So hopefully you see where your ball went because I didn't. Yeah, no, I think it's gone over the back. I think I caught it too long. So should have gone with the 52, but never mind. Yeah, it might explain the range finder. Exactly, yeah. This next hole is a nasty dog leg right par four with a hedge. And the hedge is about 180, and it's quite a big hedge, so you've got to be carrying at least 190 to, to clear the hedge. And then it's, it goes around to the right. Is Danny going to clear the hedge? Got a nice headwind into us as well. business. See where that that's, went. That's on the green of the par three. That. So after my away with tee shot, well, I say away with it went straight. Oh, is it one thirty-eight? Par three, a couple of holes back, but I managed to get a nice one. Second oh, shot, I'm just down yeah. there, right well, in the bunker. Yeah. Nice little chip over that. Dan's just here. Guess what club he's got in his hand. No bunker. Oh, well, he does love a bunker. Hashtag bunkfest 2021. So we're just coming up to a, the last hole on the on the back nine at Garrens. I'll let Danny speak for this one because I play here all the time. What, what, what did you say? Um, it's, a nice, it's a nice course, it's well kept. Um, I don't like some of the holes just purely because I nearly got into double figures. Um, but that's no fault of the, the course. Um, it's, like I say, I think you've got three nines, so you've got the choice to mix it up as well. Really busy today, but that's to be expected. It's sort of the first bank holiday sort of weekend running up to since the golf has um, been allowed back. So imagine it'd be this busy all the time um, but yeah I, would, I recommend trying it um, I think for me it's 27 pounds for today's round so reasonable cost as well it's not too bad so yeah here's a thumbs up thumbs up from us